Yo, what is up YouTube? This is Cobalt Justice, bringing you the final part of my Super Mario 3D World 100% guide. Um, so going into World Crown, this will be the final world of the game. It's split into three parts. One of them is a mystery house, which consists of 30 green stars to get. Another one is another one of those Captain Toad challenges. And then the final one is like toughest level of this game. Not the toughest Mario level ever in my opinion, but definitely the toughest of this game. I would highly, highly recommend that you get a Tanuki suit and get a second one in storage for this level. It's very difficult. Um, but yeah, other than that, enjoy.
and that's going to do it. Thank you so much guys for joining me for this guide. Um, I know I didn't get every single stamp. Um, if you notice, they're right here. There's a few missing stamps. You get those by clearing every single level with the exception of Champions Road with every character. Um, I can give you a quick glimpse of what that'll actually look like. Alright, so here on my original file that I played through, um, I went through and cleared it with every single character, so as you can see, you get these little paw print shape marks in the top right screen when you get through each level with every character and clear every possible thing. Um, this is very time consuming, which is why I didn't want to do it for this guide, and it's pretty straightforward. Obviously, I played through all the levels, so now you guys can go back and play through them with everyone else. Um, I also forgot to mention, and I apologize for this, you may need to go back because um, to get to World Crown, you have to have gotten every single gold flag on the flagpole, which means hitting the top of the flagpole on every single level. Um, I did miss that on a few of these levels on my walkthrough, and I apologize for that. Um, but I did go back and do that to get to World Crown. Um, if you want to get the five stars on your profile, you do have to beat every single level with every character. Um, that's not only to get all the stamps, as you can see here, um, but it will give you the fifth star on your profile. The only level you don't have to beat is Champions Road with every single character. You only have to beat that with one. But once you do that, you'll get five stars. And if you avoided using the uh, golden uh, or the white Tanuki suit, rather, on any of the levels to beat it then uh, you'll get five shimmering stars instead of just five stars. So yeah, anyway, thank you so much guys for joining me for this walkthrough, and I uh, hope to see you in my other walkthroughs.